with the uh, Nuts Cup, which is uh, a tribute to um, one of the ex-crossfitters who volunteered to uh, go and serve our country. He was all about making a difference in life. Is kind of sounds kind of corny, but that's sort of what we're trying to do is make a difference. So it's a tribute to him and to his family and uh, basically to sort of live his philosophy and, and uh, just live life to the fullest and put it all out there on the floor. So we put up $5,000 in prize money and uh, the first place team wins $3,000. So we've got people from uh, the Pacific Northwest and Western Canada, some of the best crossfitters in that region, coming here to compete in teams of three. Yeah, there's definitely some teams that are pretty competitive and are going to do pretty well. And uh, I, think it's, I think it's a pretty good balance. So. I, think, yeah, I think anytime you get a bunch of CrossFitters together, everybody wants to win. The common bond of CrossFitters is uh, it's hard. Anything in life that's worthwhile is earned. Nothing in life that was ever given that's ever worth anything. You have to earn it, so it's like your fitness. You really have to earn it. Somebody like me has been in CrossFit for seven, eight months, can compete against people from all over Canada who have been in CrossFit for, you know, some of them for 10 years, maybe more. A lot of teams are really serious. I think we're pretty much around to be serious. We, uh, let's say this is first place, this is 40th. We'd be happy anywhere above here. We look at our strengths and weaknesses. If you follow Lord of the Rings, he's kind of built like a cave troll. <laughs> She's kind of built like a hobbit, and I'm kind of built like an elf. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's really nice that everyone really like leaves their ego at the door. So I give us a couple seconds. We gotta warm yeah, up. Just, warm just up. give us a second. Gotta get smoke. Okay. What do you need? Everyone's stoked on how much you can do, as much as you can physically do. Ah, 999. As long as you don't give up and. You know, uh, uh, give it your all, everyone's stoked. Team Hot Sauce! Me personally, I'm sort of a sideshow. Uh, we're gonna be uh, shaving me down, the beard and, and some body hair. And uh, people are buying patches, sort of buying real estate. <laughs> so the money's going to youth at risk uh, in downtown Vancouver, sort of disadvantaged kids, get them uh, involved in community activities and, and get them active. You're probably in the top 10 uh, having fun of all yeah. of these. Yeah, I would say that. Everyone's smiling, hugging each other, we're all sweaty and having a good time, and it's it's what CrossFit is all about, is the, the interpersonal relationships you build through, through shared suffering. It doesn't get any better than this. This is just fabulous how you just have the whole CrossFit community trying to expand, introduce new people to a good all-around fitness, health, and serving the community. This is fabulous. Look at this. What other kind of like exercise or any other kind of community that you, do you know that you get like all these people together, honor somebody, and also just have like a great time? You know, it was uh, it was all right for us. I think uh, it was a rough first one. I think we might have expected to do a little better, but <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to do a little better in the next one. That's for sure. CrossFit is you uh, made a workout in, in Andy's name. Uh, it's called a Hero Workout. So uh, to honor that, we the final workout is the Nuts Workout, which you see on the back. That's the workout, right? Kind of what we wanted to do, so it was, uh, we were pretty happy with it. Uh, the first workout, the runs went pretty well, and then the snatch, we did exactly what we could do in there. And then uh, third workout, I think we came in first on that one, so it was, I think we did our transitions really well, and then went balls out on the last one. It definitely pushes you when when somebody steps up to the plate. You know you have to be that much better, and you it, it really propels you to that next level. It's places where you don't think you could have gone without someone there pushing you. And that's that's why I love this.